Dude, I'm not lost yet. Look at it. You, you he will dead. do it. Come on. He no. will do it. No, the stun from the bird is yeah, first. He, oh, he interrupted <laughs> the stun actually. Holy <laughs> shit. I can't. Shit. So I already played today like one deep run, so I kind of know already what to do in the early waves. They don't have to know. Okay. Pretend that you're a pro. <laughs> <laughs> it's gonna be like your first run. Oh, but I know that this is already oh. enough. It's the cheapest ray. You still stay above 120. And... Uh, Oh, such a surprise, you won! <laughs> yeah, and get Hooray. enough interest, right? So, on this one, I will just use him as a tank. Move him a little bit more back. And that should also work. Again, 120. So, getting uh, 6 extra points. Which is totally unnecessary. Um, yeah, I mean, cool, today's... Cool. Today's deck is pretty <laughs> cheap, that's yeah. true. I mean, on uh, expensive decks as well. What? Sorry? Ah, ah you mean on expensive Kids, decks? Don't, don't save your coins. No, I do. I can't. I, it's like... I need to do it. So 140 on this. Like addiction to you. Yes. I might, I mean I will go a little bit more safe, right? Not uh, go em yes, embarrassing please. or something. That's not the <laughs> problem. <laughs> oh, we we are not making any cuts. You you die on wave four. We done for today. Ah, that's sad. No pressure. So. This might be also possible with like without the atlas or something, but I should go safe. Actually, it's kind of bad that he focused my range on now. Yeah, that that's how I died. That wasn't okay. supposed to happen. And also the stun missed. Holy shit! That was kind of lucky, I guess. But you have no damage like this one. Holy now. shit! Yeah. Just and we done. It's no, 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 no. Hey, come on, wait, wait, it was so second. easy. Dude, I'm not lost yet. Look at it. You, you he will dead. do it. Come on. He no. will do it. No, the stun from the bird is yeah, first. He, he, oh, he interrupted the <laughs> stun actually. Holy <laughs> shit. But I still think I got it. It's so hilarious. I mean, you have to start with a little. Oh, come look, on, look. bird. Come easy. on. Easy. <laughs> totally <Jesus>. clean. <laughs> they thought that it's going like. Good, like we done after to four waves. Totally and... clean. I don't oh. know what you mean. <laughs> that was cleanest mm. wave I ever had. That's hilarious. I mean, you have to start with a nerf wreck, right? <laughs> <laughs> okay. So enough of nerf wrecking for now. Mhm. Mm okay. uh, I hope to see like wave thirty plus, right? Have mercy, die on like wave 15. Oh. Oh. <laughs> or like here, so you have no checkpoints to use. That would be crazy, right? That would be blessing. No. Why are, why are you ask on me? Uh. So, anyway, for the gameplay. Uh, I think that today Earth is a huge helper. I think that Earth is like pretty OP Any and boring uh, anyway. Actually, I don't remember this wave so good, but I think this should be enough. Oh no, I had triple bulwark for sure. Uh, do I need him? Yeah, I add him instead of him. 
the triple bulwark, but that should be enough already. <clears throat> hopefully, hopefully. Even overkill. No, no, they uh, get hyper both and uh, Axelon with. No, but the Ranger is like. Okay. I mean, it is that kind was of, like, yeah. It, it is kind of overkill. I'm sure you can do this better, but uh, be like more safe, right? And yep. actually, as long as I stay above 100, it's uh, totally fine, I guess. So I actually don't know. I think I, I like this guy. I mean, I go just like this. Come on. This wraith is like basically no re real threat, only those two units, right? And yep. uh, the Lulura or the Lura is already pretty strong on those early wraiths. So, actually, huge overkill, but. I don't remember any more when I put in like better tanks. I think it was here already. I think it was here. Let's see. So I can go granite. F3 Bulwark still because my Ranger is locked to him. Six Earths, that's actually overkill, but I go for it. <laughs> Just take out the damage early on and then we are good to go. Could for sure left the Scorpy out, would be too interest more. Uh, yeah, whatever. It's also like, it's kind of good that I don't remember like every wave so good, right? So we can... Yep, but the first and the last time when you you played before streaming, Mr. Timmy, what? I need you like... We need your face on the camera on your first run, so we need <laughs> to see like you're stressing and, and sweating, cursing. Eight hours already. Using That's some bad German us. words. <laughs> okay. This was actually a pretty easy wave. But... Eight earth, come on, use some points, give us nine. No, why? It's so, I mean, I could Dark. even remove this guy. This wraith is no threat at all. The damage is easy, accessible. I have eight earth, nothing is dying, and like, whatever. Mm. And I didn't even use, lost a single unit. <laughs> right, <laughs> it's overkill already. So on this wave, it's kind of tough with eight Earths because they are very tanky actually. So I will not use him here. I think he's not needed here, but I will start to to oh, use him. Snake on the board. I do think he's a very, very, very good, uh, very good. <laughs> Damage dealer, actually one of my favorite ones, and I will bind him to him. This way I still have Granite, but I also have Arcanite. And 
for you. I, I haven't used Arcanite in a long time. I even will provide him augments. So I actually go... No. 99. My heart would say no. So I have to do this. Or and... go for 99. No. <laughs> give the viewers the pleasure to watch you like... 99 is not... Dying possible. inside. <laughs> So from that wave on it's pretty straightforward I think because the waves are not that tough today and the earth is helping a lot plus the granite for sure. Grokostan, yay! Groko got his stun, but now we're waiting for the Goliath. Oh, actually, stun? He is, no. Uh, oh, maybe? Dead. Yep. That's scary. Good job. Good job. Holy shit. That's actually scary. Oh. Timmy, Holy you remember shit. your first rule protect the snake. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I uh, usually <laughs> I think I had an augment on, on him to survive longer. So, therefore. But it, I mean, it was messy, but it still worked out, right? Fraggy would be disappointed right now. So, on this we can go this. Actually, you take the Malura. And you take all the shit. And we will provide augments to you as well, to get you more strong. I give him this because this is a tank wave and also everybody gets like 10% more damage. And I even give him this now. And that should be it. I think. Maybe I should add a third bulwark at least. He has bulwark. Maybe that's why he died so fast. Yeah. <laughs> and how much is bulwark? Like 200 HP? 400 HP 400. Even and 20 resistances. Jeez, yeah, that, that's huge if you hit the. Mark. I mean, that was already overkill with the augments, right? <laughs> yeah. So, another huge rogue wave. We will just go here. So just position like this, he has granite anyway and will be tanking the snake, they kill the snake and after that they turn to Doka, actually I, yeah, I think Doka can run here and then killing the assassins. The what assassins are kind of scary, that's why I will bring in the third bulwark. I choose you. Let's go. Actually, 38 okay, already. Oh, oh you messed that's up crazy. hard. Yeah, usually I would have like buff 100 here, right? But at least 40. I mean, this should be good for many raves to come. I don't remember anymore. I think we still focus this side, right? I don't know. 
but we should be good, I think. That's actually scary, that he's, I think, I'm, my yep. thingy will get his AoE damage. I think I died here today. The but nature kills me. Very soon. Soon and heal. Uh, heal. Yeah, I mean, no damage anymore, and then you're yeah. good to go, right? So let's recap. We have 100 left that I need, 190, and this one, 245, and 90 in augments. So 335 is left that I need. So this ref is actually something like this. I do think I have played um, longer with him as a tank, like Bulwark, not, not as Arcanite. That's why I'm missing a tank. Usually I would already have um, so, blue so that's not, it's not your uh, late game build right now? You're gonna transition later? Um, uh, kind of, kind of. I mean, not a real transition, but I will swap his augments out and will bring in some like expensive units, right? Mm -hmm. So my main carry later on will be Dualef. But, but he would be too expensive yep. for now. And the rangers stays with sword? The, the rangers stays with granite arcanite, yes. Okay, but yep. um, I do think last time I did it later. Because yep. uh, now I'm kind of forced to have like the little Groko in. And usually I had already not the, the little Groko in. Um, but therefore the earth rock, Lulura. Lulura is very strong. But it doesn't matter, I mean, you, you can easily play um, just like this now. If that was the, the way I died. It took me so long to kill this turtle. And the rogues killed me. I mean, this rape is kind of... Uh, and this is I not needed, it's right? <laughs> this, that, this is not needed. But yeah. yes, they have a lot of heal power here, right? When they ramp up. But I mean... Furios have... is very strong. Yeah, you have much more damage. Yeah. I had like... I had no Furyx in my team today. I think. Nice. Yeah, I mean, I have already like no money, right? But I don't actually need that much money anymore. Only 190 here. Yep, and how many arguments you have left in your uh, deck? Oh, 90, I think. Yeah, 90. So. This I will tank with the ranger. Actually, he's kind of an off tank in this comp for now because he has granite, right? And he can tank the units that I'm killing first, so that's not a problem for him. Um, I do think I will use this little one to tank him at least. You will take all the aggro here and lure the psion beam to this side so he doesn't get hit. And you can just get the cooker. And we should be good here. Oh, this is very familiar. Like after the patch. He's so tanky. Like yeah. give him augments and he is immortal. He just jumps to the back line. But this look, I, I think I don't even lost a single unit, right? No. 
<laughs> and so much hyper and all this stuff. <laughs> So here we go again. Oh, sorry on the links. This, like, actually, I can just press play. Let's see. Can I? Pretty much. So just remove the damage. Make sure that the three damage dealers are killed first. And then it's good to go. We're not doing Omegas. Oh, nice. No, just kill me. Oh, still overkill, right? You can go yeah. for very much more mastery points, but it's just not needed today. What do we got here? Two little rogues. Three rocks on this side, so this rave is actually pretty easy, I would say. We can go like somewhere, like put him here to be safe. Maybe here, Maybe here. You are actually not needed here for sure, because the rock doesn't make sense. But therefore, then we use this guy. Not that there we need him. Go. Yeah, we don't. Oh, we, we, can don't we don't need him actually. But it's just to to fill the comp more. Yeah. We can be a little bit fancy with twenty, and you almost have full team. Yeah, so this is only like rogue, right? And after that, it's just easy. After you remove them, and now the bean came. Oh, actually, I have to cook the bean with him. The dwellef is not ready for now. He doesn't have any augments or, or some stuff. I yep, will swap but he, it out. He benefits from two invokers, right? That's you already true. have. Yeah. And also, I have six Sion now, which is also crazy. So let's go. <laughs> um, I will remove the augments now. We do him. Add some extra safety. I will give him crit now, risk crit and precision. And the Omega Power Augment for sure. Also with uh, crit and savagery. And then uh, you get pierce. And a text. So just like this, I will focus the right side, whatever. I don't know. Is it needed? I also don't know. Yeah, just the left side is kind of scary. They have. Are those I mean, you can. Links as rogue? You, you can choose either side, I think, because yeah. either side has. Uh, Squishy damage dealers. Um, it doesn't like change anything. The problem here is the Lulura or the little rogues that can like interrupt you crazy. And this side, ah, I do think I had Lulura on here. I actually will bring him in now. Oh, there are only two rogues on enemy sides. Oh, th that's the wave with two Scion Lynxes, right? Yes, on the yes, left. yes, yes. Those they are can scary. Mess. <laughs> yeah. yeah, those yeah. are scary. Scion Lynx can mess you up. Yeah. Actually, Not I quite need a little bit of money here. Yeah. But anyway, he has granite, so he doesn't need his armor for now. And, uh, yeah. and it's already done. Oh. Yeah, now they're disappearing. Yeah, the, the, those two are very strong now. Do I left yep. and thing? So I will and give him armor back now. And even the the snail is making is doing a lot of damage. Uh, 
actually I will go this side here. So I actually went from the right side to I, like to beam I, rogues. Yeah. I did one time too, but on this run so there's no real damage threats besides the rogues, right? Mm -hmm. So, and if I focus the sites where the rogues are, so they will be here, then the rogues die very fast. And actually the second most uh, scary unit to kill will be Titaner, because he's like a, the biggest tank. And this way, I think he will receive the beam from Dualef. Uh, mm -hmm. So it should be pretty easy. The beam may, may go to the, to the trust bird. That went wrong, but it doesn't matter actually. <laughs> yeah, uh, he yeah, beamed. Okay, too. but but see. the titans <laughs> were like, no, no, I want the beam. Yeah, I want <laughs> beam. Could you show the damage tab? I see, like C fours. C fours is kind damage. of okay, right? Yes, yeah. with invoker, and I mean. He is 55 mastery points for Invoker and Granite, which are two very good uh, augments or, or affinity uh, composites. Better to say. Yeah, and from that on point on, like this placement actually is always the same. You either decide, uh, you only decide which which side you want to go. This one I like always to be on the sh shitbird. Uh, do we need another augment? Or oh, we ha only have one augment left. Yeah. This augment actually will go on... Um, on Umbra later on. So we actually only need Umbra anymore and then we are good to go with the last augment. So one... 130 and then I think we will later not use a little... Uh, Groko anymore, but the other tank, the links. Actually, that was not supposed to happen here, but it doesn't change much. Doesn't look too clean though, but the next beam is coming. Would have been cleaner for sure. So here I just go like from this side and on this wave I think it's only important to make sure that a possible um, a possible whirlwind from the bird will not land on all your carries. So I will move him a little bit more like here and do I have. No, I don't have. So usually I already have Rake here and to have like double steam, but it's not needed, I think. Oh, so this will also be a big beam, I guess. Oh, poor Grok. Actually, he gets interrupted. That's scary. Yes. Pretty scary, but I mm -hmm. still think I'm good. Hopefully, for the next team. Yeah. Oh, okay. Still good. Actually, went pretty wrong, right? That he got interrupted yes. so early. But still, it's enough. Because the damage is just insane. So... What do we got here? On this wave, actually, I will build up here. You will go, you have this, you both have it. So you will go on this guy. Actually, you tank here, doesn't matter really. And he tanks both assassins that join. 
and you can head onto the bird. Actually, no. You help Crocking Saccharine because they are soon finished, right? Yeah. And they they both have it, right? Yeah. Blaze Knight and yeah. But I want to have him already proc yeah. Saccharine when this is finished so that but, they can yeah. kill him. But actually, remember, uh, the beam doesn't care about this. Oh, but yeah, I know, but the beam won't focus on here, right? Yeah. Actually, he still lives. What's up? What's going on here? <laughs> So, now I can just upgrade him and have like basically full board and only need one more augment. And you're not going to change any on it, so it's your... Uh, the like only thing I will change later, game? I think, is to remove the Groko for the Stoic Links because 8 mm -hmm. Earth doesn't make a huge difference and he has like... Or maybe it's not even good because at least he has like 40 grit and resolve, right? But he only has 1.2k HP even with Bulwark buff. Ah, kind of tough one, I think. So, what do we do here? I actually think... I will tank him with only this guy, move him a little bit more here. This guy again on the bird, you helping on the bird, even though he has this thing, and you. What are you going to do? Actually, then you take him. Because why not? Forgot anything? No. <laughs> Let's go. He's in a scary position, actually, for my dual left. Dead. Maybe not soon. No heal from the turtle. Oh, and they healed. Come nice. on, beam. It's totally fine. Look at Okay, not totally fine, but still. <laughs> enough and the and oh, oh my god like the energy on replants was so crazy just like just like from zero to 100 just like whoop <laughs> so we kind of get to the more difficult race i guess and that run i think i messed up this wraith Sometime. So you will for sure tank all of this. This guy I will use to mess up like those two because he can interrupt this with his. Or this, this ray was weird. I mean, this is only Scion guy, right? The little ram fight should not be a big problem. But you going to help here. So. I don't think I need to tank Ram fight. Maybe I can put him here. Maybe he gets lured to him this way. Yeah. He has no arguments. He's not gonna do too much to you anyway. Yeah. Is he pure fire? Holy shit, look at how much he lured. I mean, it's... Uh, so the much beam gonna be so nice. Yeah. He basically kills everything in this line. Yeah. <laughs> Three units dead. So now we got the last augment. I just give him 
bit into tech speed, whatever. This side is for sure the focus. Just build up again like this. Always make sure that the dual left is not like the last unit to maybe get hit by the whirlwind or whatever. You just help here. You go on the bird. You off tank all those rocks. And you do whatever. You are free. So let's go. Free to you are free to die first. <laughs> yeah. I mean, he's actually tanky. Okay, maybe not that bad. <laughs> oh, the beam got interrupted instantly. But how? I don't know. What happened there? But it doesn't matter. Right? This wave is not very yeah. hard, I think. He is not gonna die soon because he's like even hyper mode. And those are only healers, right? Okay, uh, actually he dies. Scary. But now they okay, look, now they run into they focus turn, and yeah. basically to the rest. <laughs> Imagine if they focus. Okay, never mind. He he's dead anyway. So what do you think? Should I upgrade him? I do think that he has two less HP. To be like, just viable. leave him for fun. So, on this, I think I focus this side. It's actually scary because of the rogues, so much rogues in it. And who would be your replacement for Groko? Uh, the tank links. Oh, yeah, yeah. the three legged links. You go here. Uh, you can actually. There's a shit bird hidden behind this, and I want those guys on the shit bird. Hopefully. And you will be replaced now with this one. Like this. Could you could you uh, swap to damage tap on this wave? Sure. Let's see who is the boss here. Okay. And the beam. Okay, of course. Do the first. <laughs> I mean. I would have preferred the bird, but it doesn't matter. So those two pretty even, right? But um, yeah. the dual left is like whatever he but focuses, this line is just dead. Yep. But the ranger wasn't too far after yeah, them. He's decent. Uh, I do think. What did I do here? I do think I focused left side on here. I don't remember that well. But uh, I will do it. Kinda scary because you are like uh, so much AoE stunts, right? Coming this way then. So if you focus left side, all those stunts will land here. Here I have a clear target for my rogues. You can just tank those here and you go just like here. And what augments uh, Blaze Knight has? Blaze Knight? Yep, the enemy one. Two Omega power. Okay. And. Uh, so no, speed. Omega power and shit. Scary. For. Yeah. I mean, we are already like, we have no augments left and our deck is actually how I wanted it to be, right? Triple Granite, two Steam, two Invoker, two Arcanite. Hmm. And so now we're now just cruising, yep. Yeah, now it's just uh, placements, right? 
I hope I don't mess up anything like big time. Actually, it's in invulnerable at the start of the combat. I didn't remember that. Oh, and the stun from the guy. It kind of looks scary. But I your snake may. Yeah. I do think well effort every this. Yeah. I hope. Oh, so there far the biggest damage may be was done by a snake and his splash damage. Yeah, yeah, that's true. So still kind of sloppy, but still uh, very much enough, right? Yes. So, 31 at least checkpoint. We <laughs> still got everything, I think. Yes, we still got all checkpoints. Yep, and nice. now it's getting like harder for sure. Let's go. <laughs> yep. It's getting harder for sure. We will go like on this side. Uh, just place as always. Make sure this guy is the last one. Um, you mm. lure this and you help here or no, you help on this side, whatever. And this wave looks kind of easy, right? They, they have a lot of damage, kind of but easy. the damage can yeah. be very easily removed. Yeah. I think it's kind of easy. Okay, okay, that oh, didn't okay. went to plan. Holy no. shit. <laughs> but go away, Mr. Vampire. Should be good. Thanks. Yeah. yeah. Okay. I mean, he's kind of free now. Ah. Okay. Okay. Yeah, got <laughs> it. Okay, that was actually pretty, pretty scary. <laughs> that he went just here to say hello. So this wave, I think. Ah, uh, this was actually a pretty tough one. This was a tough one. I do think it's a tough one. So on this wave I actually have to tank the Umbra with my with my Cephorus and also the ram fight is coming in, that's a problem. You have to tank all the right sides. You go on this Psion thing to just interrupt him. You, I just put here to help kill this. But there is a lot of damage coming in, and if those two dies, I'm pretty done. This is and you're gonna very possible to lose. And you're gonna spend a lot of time to kill uh, Seer, right? Before you turn. Mm, he's actually dying pretty soon, but also those two are pretty soon dying. And those will get hit by the, like the Umbra. Mm -hmm. Like this guy will has Saccharine, so he will go with IOE damage to them as well. And then like ramp fight also coming in, that's when you usually die. But um, let's see. I think this might win. So Saccharine already prox, here already dead. Now but this guy will live oh, up. Oh. Right. Holy shit. That was kind of fine. I think I'm Fine, maybe? Uh huh, okay. Oh, not. <laughs> Holy <laughs> shit, that was close. You just disappeared. Yeah, something went wrong here, right? I do think I should not prox the saccharine that early. So, thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed the first gameplay video of my. Uh, learn some stuff maybe. Feel free to ask questions of, about some raves in the comment sections or whatever. If you want to know something in specific, you can put the comment right down and we can go through that rave tomorrow in the training deck. So, thank you very much, stay tuned and see you soon!